What's going on guys, Kevin Kessie Kid here and we're back to playing Outlast Whistleblower, the final episode. Which is probably five or f fucking six or something. I just count of how many episodes there is and you forget, blah blah blah. The point of this is, this is the last episode. I don't know how long this, I don't care how long this takes, we're just gonna do it. We need to find a key to the store. In our previous episode we got to chase off some guy who wanted to make us his, uh, make us his little bitch, make us his uh, wife. Called Eddie Gluskin. And he's an asshole because he tried to uh, butcher us privately. If you want to know what that means, do click on the like previous episode. Uh, for now, we'll just continue on. We need to find a key to this door to what appears to be the male ward. So we're going to be hospitalized. What I really want is to just get out of here. What is this room? It looks like spikes or something. Maybe the note will tell us because, you know, I might see something different from what Miles or, sorry, Waylon sees Bluebeard's wives. Bodies hanging like wet laundry, like skinned rabbits. Men mutilated, hunted and murdered. The shortest distance between any two points separates violence and ruined lust. Whatever story he's telling himself, he's not making women to bear his children. He's making women to kill them. Lisa, I want you to burn this place and any evidence it ever existed to the ground. Destroy the Morkov Corporation, bury it in shame, take away its money, wipe it from history. This man thinks he's in love, he thinks the therapy made him better. Everything reeks of death and fear. Piss and coppery blood meet decomposing the game. Or two games. So, clearly, like, everybody in this game is corrupt. Clearly. Plus, I'm, like, limping because I'm, like, I have, I got impaled in the foot by, like, a piece of wood or something. I thought I was going to have to hide in the fridge there. But, like, this whole fucking, this whole scenario here has me thinking I have to, like, Hide somewhere. I don't know. Like, look at that guy there hanging out with a fucking ceiling. I'm honestly like, this game just makes you shit yourself in humongous ways. I guess I'm preparing for jumps. Yes. Oh, it it is women hanging from the ceiling. Dead naked women. In a basketball court, of all places. The music isn't helping the situation. And he seems to have lights in the center. And the note on the ground. What's the note say? Scatula. Is that French? Dunja to suit. It's written in French. So, we're not going to know what it means. Because even if we could speak a mild bit of French, it's written very, very hard to read. I'm not going to go translating it. <laughs> Let's just assume it was one of the women that wrote it. Or something like that. There's more notes over here. And they say the same thing. Do say. Dune je te sunte des trois. At the element shed. I think it's something to do with like they're not gonna escape from here. The elements are clearly not in their favour. My battery wastes so fucking quick. When I was a boy, my mother said to me, He's back. Okay, where is he? He has gone so psycho. <laughs> Dear old dad. He's singing like incorrect lyrics I think as well from what I've gathered. I remember reading up on this kind of out of curiosity 
just from as far as I've played so far. And it says something like the lyrics are replaced kind of slightly in a negative way. I don't know which way I'm to go. He's after stop the singing. I'm not even joking, I'm shitting her right now. M maybe we're meant, meant to go up here. Oh, the key! I get it! Get! Get! Do we push this? Come on! Come on! Where am I going? Honestly! Where the fuck am I going? No, 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 you don't! No, you don't, Eddie Glushkin! Going back the way I came. I think, I think, I think. Let's, let's pray that I can go back the way I came. Oh, I'm so trembly! <laughs> can't see where I'm going. I honestly can't see where I'm going. So I am shitting an actual an actual brick because I can't see where I'm going. This says exit. I would laugh if this is basically the end of the game. Oh shit! Fuck's sake! You can hang. Oh no, Jesus Christ! Jesus! Heavier than you look. The fuck! This is you on the honeymoon. I hate to imagine. Oh Jesus! Yeah, because I'm fat. Like, oh my god. Hold still. God damn it, what are you. Oh, damn it, darling. I didn't hear you. Hey. We could have. What is he doing? Fuck's sake. Is he dead? Did he just like hang himself? Ooh. Yes! Eddie Gluskin is no more. That man tried to cut off our Mickey. <laughs> what a wanker. Anyways. A widower. He's dead, the amateur surgeon father to be husband. Yes, <laughs> exactly, that, that sums up and like, and not. His guts shredded and pulled from his belly. I'm trying not to laugh. Oh God, Lisa, I swear to you, I'm trying. I would laugh that some horrible person like that is ironically hanging from the ceiling with all his BRs, as he would probably call them, or wives to be. The only difference is they're probably in heaven while he's in hell. And now, back to this lack of camera, limpy legged arsehole of a fucking exit. Which I'm ironically praying that we're just at the end of the game. And if I. If this is a really short mission, because I don't, honestly don't know how much of the game was left, and this says exit, like. Then I apologize 100%.
Mail ward. Don't know what I did there. I should be limping. Leave the game type of thing. Blue doors like that aren't a good sign. They're usually a sign of people bursting out of them. Everything's on fire. What is that on fire? The church. Oh, is this the part where it's like tied in at miles? A chapel on fire in the distance. I didn't even know we had a church. Where is God when you need him? Indeed. Um, I have one set of batteries left actually, so that's okay. We must be nearing the end of the game because the miles part with the church he goes underground and everything goes astray and if this really does connect in with that it's Traeger not all of them attached to a man let's wrap this up and get back to the truck amen don't tell me I get chased. Real quickly, I read that note. Serve and protect. Corporate cops, mercenaries, private military contractors, whatever they call them now, they're as helpless as the rest of us. Need to get out, escape. And I'm actually questioning, because in the ending of the first game, I'm not revealing much, but let's just say they're there, and I don't know if they're good or bad guys. I have a feeling, kill anything that moves. Yeah, like us. I kind of want to go in here though. Barry's. We jump up here. Where am I trying to go, honestly, like, I... There's Traeger on the ground dead. And he got crushed. Can I not get out this way? I thought you could jump down this, or crawl underneath it. Alright, if that's the case, I gotta go back the way I came. To some degree. In this door. This very quiet... It's locked, okay, so let. It's very positive music, if I'm honest. Part of me wants to jump out this window. <laughs> Saving. Running down the hallway. The, the light shining, so there's like some positivity in mind. We might be getting out. Be running back the way I came if I have to. I'm honestly confused about how we're getting out. Like, cause I, I should know where I'm going, but I honestly, I'm not 100% certain. Library, which is locked, it's like bolted shut. That's bolted shut. Um. Lobby's downstairs, so maybe you just go downstairs. Go down the stairs once. Ah, uh, okay. Think we're okay now. I think I think we're freedom. Mr. Park. Ooh. I was reading the note. I don't know what he was even saying to me. I got too close. It's 
Billy. What now? I, is this it? Can I crawl to the end? I think he's... I don't know. I honest, well, I doubt anyone survives this. Amount of blood. Alright, whatever your man was saying is irrelevant. Let's just read his note real quick. Jeremy Blair. Jeremy Blair, my supervisor's supervisor. A man who'd see me skinned, salted, and raped for a promotion and few Martins. Martins. Injured. Dying if he's not already dead. I'm trying to feel sorry for him, really I am. But there's no way in hell he's stopping me from getting out of this godforsaken place. I'm coming home, Lisa. And he's not stopping us, because Billy just ended him. Place is absolutely fucked up. The only thing is... I can't run. I can limp. I'm getting further than Miles did anyway, put it that way. But I have little to no hope of getting fully, fully out. So I'm driving out of Miles' car. Please tell me I don't have to drive. The fuck is that? Reverse. Come on. Come on. Come on let's get out. Okay, I think we got out, probably. I'm not sure. You press that button. There's no going back, Mr. Park. There's enough hard evidence in that video file to make a world of shit for our friends at Murkoff. You got out of Mount Massive alive, and we've done everything in our power to cover your tracks. But our enemies are twitching and malicious corporate paranoics with resources you're too moral to imagine. You won't be the only target. Anyone you care about, your wife, your child, There'll be nothing to murk off but ways to hurt you. I need you to understand the bridge you're crossing here. You will do irrevocable damage to the company. You might even get close to something like justice. But once you click upload, your life is over. Everyone you love is fucked. But it's the right thing to do. <laughs> is hurting Murkoff worth that much to you? Please don't tell me I have to decide. Fuck. Okay. We got out alive. What the fuck? I did not expect to get out alive. That is insane. That is actually insane. I thought we were gonna die because, well, yeah, no spoilers. But anyways, that was amazing. Um, so that might explain how Outlast Two is coming into development next year because. Their story is out of Murkoff and, you know, Billy's at large being a ghost and all, so I guess we'll see what happens next year in terms of story-wise progression. Also, I'll try to find out what the alternative ending is to this, because if you don't click upload, I wonder what happens. Or if you just want to find out, I'll just leave it in the description below as opposed to doing a separate video on it. But anyways, thanks very much for watching, guys. If you like, subscribe, join the Kamikaze tribe, and I'll see you guys... At the next one.